What's up everybody, my name is Brandon, SHJ's YouTuber, and today I'm going to be trying Levi Ackerman's workout so you guys don't have to try it without knowing if it's good or not. At the end of the video, I will let you know how I enjoyed working out like Levi and if I think this little hit circuit is right for you guys. Now this workout is going to consist of alternating foot jump ropes, close to wide push-ups, double unders, plank to push-ups, boxer skips or jump ropes, which I have not yet mastered, dips, freestyle jump ropes, and chin-ups. Before we get into the video, if you could all please like and subscribe, that would help me out a lot, so thank you. And now please watch this short clip on how to scale this workout to fit your specific skill level. There are four different ways you guys could scale this workout. The first one being if you don't have access to some of the movements, like let's say you don't have a kettlebell or a dumbbell, you can scale by doing a calisthenics movement or a bodyweight movement. The second way you can scale is to scale down the amount of rounds you're going to be completing. So if you're really advanced, I recommend you complete anywhere from five to even more rounds if you could handle it. If you're a super beginner and you really have never worked out, I recommend you push yourself but not too hard. Maybe complete anywhere from two to three rounds. Most of these workouts are going to have jump ropes. For scaling jump ropes, you could either do high knees or toe taps or you could do jumping jacks. Now if the workout calls for double unders, of course you could scale down to regular jump ropes if you cannot complete double unders. The fourth and final way you can scale is by changing the amount of reps or changing the weight you are using. If you need any more advice for scaling, use our ultimate calisthenics workout and guide and it will have tons and tons of advice for scaling. Please like and subscribe and we'll get right into the workout now. Thank you all so much for watching that video. This is definitely a good circuit for you all to try. A full body weight, you didn't use any dumbbells or kettlebells or things like that. Um, so you're just doing some push-ups. Dips, if you have a dip bar. If you don't have a dip bar, you could do them on your couch or chair. Just be careful, of course. And then chin-ups, if you don't have a pull-up bar or chin-up bar, um, you could do something else. Maybe like pike push-ups, use your resistance band and do like a lat pull-down. Before you all head out, if you could please like and subscribe, that would help me out a lot, so thank you. And I will see you all on the next video.